Hello math lovers, welcome back to math mood. Here we have interesting potential equation 2 to the power x times 3 to the power x equal to 1 over 6 all to the power x minus 3. On the first side this potential equation is really hard because we have different bases, we have a different exponent as well and on the first side it will be really hard but it's for sure a really simple algebra question so just watch this three minutes video and we will solve this for sure and i think if you don't like math you like this solution as well so what rules we need right here the first rule we need is when we have a to the power x times b to the power x it will be equal to a to the power a times b to the power x so if we have the same exponent but different bases we just multiply our bases as well Okay, the next rule we need is when we have, for example, 1 over x, it would be equal to x to the minus 1 power. This is a really cool rule, this rule you should know is when we have, for example, x in denominator, if we want this in denominator, we just write a minus in our exponent. So, let's use this rule right here, I think you, you understand me x the same and a this is a and this is b so we will have 2 times 3 to the power x equal to and use this rule right here we don't need our 6 in denominator so just take a 6 in our denominator so it will be equal to 6 to the minus 1 power and all raised to the power 2x minus 3 as well. So this we can multiply because this is a rule if we have a to the power m raised to the power n we just multiply our exponents. So this would be equal to 6 to the power x equal to 6 to the power minus 2x minus 3 and the last step we have the same basis but a different exponent on the first side but we don't need just to write an equation with our exponents x will be equal to minus 2x plus 3 there's nothing hard we drop this minus 2x right here so we will have this with a plus sign, so 2x plus x it will be equal to 3x equal to 3. And this is a solution. x will be equal to 1. Really good potential equation, different bases, and we remember or we learn a lot of rule. So I think this is a really cool solution. If you have a question or subscribe for more videos and see you in the next videos.